。今天的这个事情发生在美国的新墨西哥州，一名警察在巡逻的时候，发现前方有一辆车行驶异常，于是就查询了车牌号。这不查不知道，一查吓一跳。发现司机的驾照被吊销了，车牌和保险也都有问题，而且还有一张逮捕令。警察准备对这辆车进行拦停，不料这辆车开始加速逃跑，跑了一段距离后，终于停了下来。我们先来看看执法记录仪的画面。Hey man, do me a favor, roll all your windows down. Roll all your windows down. Hey. Roll your windows down, all of them. Hey, I'm Officer Eagle, Police Department. Why are you being so evasive, man? I'm gonna stop you, and you're hauling ass everywhere. Roll this one all the way down for me. Oh yeah. Yeah, man, you're booking it through these neighborhoods. You see me turn on my lights, and you're suddenly zigzagging around all these corners. What, what's the rush, man? I you saw me pulling up from the store. I was I was driving perfectly fine. Okay. Once you hit these neighborhoods, you're zigzagging real quick style, man. Do you have your driver's license on you today? I do not, sir. Okay. Do you have an ID card? I do not. Okay. Okay. Any weapons in the vehicle? No, sir. No. Okay. Whose car is this? My wife. Your wife. Okay. So the reason I'm stopping you is I'd initially run your license plate. It's saying that the owner of this vehicle has a warrant, and it mentioned that the plates and insurance are suspended. That's why I'm going to stop you. I was going to pull you over way back there, but as you're going through these neighborhoods, you're booking it, man. It's 25 through here. There's no way you were doing 25. Stop making excuses, man. I'm not making excuses. I'm being honest with you, officer. I don't know what the reason why you're stopping me. No, I just I just told you all the reasons why I was stopping you. What do you mean I was thinking I was driving perfectly fine? If you were going the speed limit, man, you wouldn't have made it more than two blocks from the time I turned my lights on. But you're passing through pretty quickly, man. What's your name, bro? No, Steve. What is it? My name. That's what I ask. What is your name? I don't answer questions. You don't answer questions. Turn off the vehicle. Why should I? Because you're going to be detained if you refuse to give me your information. Yes. You sure you want to play this game, bro? I will tase you in a half second. Turn the vehicle off right now. Okay. Open that door and step out. Bro, you're going to get tased if you do not listen. I'm not playing this stupid game with you. Okay. Open that door and step out. Do it, man. And do not make any sudden movements. Keep your hands where I can see them. Okay. Well, we're not gonna play this game. Step out. I just came to the Step station. out of the vehicle like I told you to. Keep your hands up. Walk towards the back of your car. I'll tase you through the window if I have to, bro. Keep your hands where I can see them. Turn around. Turn around. Put your hands behind your back. Put your hands behind your back, or you're gonna get tased. Do me a favor, man. Cuff them up. You're being detained right now, man. Pending investigation. Why detained? I'll tell you why in a second. You're being evasive when I'm trying to stop you. You're refusing to give me your name and date of birth. That's considered concealing identity. 这位男士刚开始就拒绝出示驾照，也拒绝透露自己的身份信息。那么司机在被警察拦停的时候，到底能不能拒绝向警察出示证件和身份信息呢？可能美国每个州对此规定不一样。根据新墨西哥州的法律规定，在这种情况下，司机必须向警察表明身份，否则就有可能会被指控犯有轻罪，这会导致最高六个月的监禁以及最高五百美元的罚款。这位男士拒绝向警察表明身份，所以警察现在已经将他拘留了。Come back this way, man. You said you refused to give me your information. Well, guess what? You have to give me your information on a traffic stop. Yes, you did. You said I don't have to give you that information. I said, why should I ask her questions? Nah, he's just detained. You cannot detain me for no reason. I'm detaining you under suspicion of concealing identity, man. No, you cannot. Hey, you just detained. That's it. You know what that means? What what that means? It means we're gonna conduct an investigation. We're gonna figure out who you are. I have nothing in my. I just went to the store to get something for my kids. Just sit down and we'll we'll explain to you, dude. Just fucking relax. You you have a seat. You guys making me waste my time for no reason. No, you're wasting our time. Have a seat. Swing your legs. Swing your legs and. I know my rights. Guess what? You're under arrest now for obstructing an officer. Now you are under arrest. Step out again. We're gonna no. No. Step out. 情节转变的太快啊！警察让男士坐进车里，男士不听从，于是警察立刻又让他下车，因为性质改变了。刚才是拘留，现在是逮捕。美国的拘留通常指的是限制对方的行动啊，以对他进行调查，只是调查，没有指控任何的罪名。但是逮捕就不一样了，逮捕就是指控了某种罪名，比如说这位男士不配合警察，那么警察就以妨碍公务为由将他逮捕，这就是逮捕与拘留的区别。
Sorry, but, hey, I'll You're not going to do this, bro. You okay. sure you want to play this no, game? No, no, I don't. Okay, I don't. then I knock don't. your off. Okay. Guess what? You are now under arrest. You were just detained. No, but I, if you want to be stupid, no, this no, is what's no. happening. Please do not. So, no, you, you're under arrest please, for obstructing an officer. I have kids. I don't. I you are under arrest. Hey, please. You have kids, right? 12 Central. Log this detainee as a 1015. Officer, Guess please. what, bro? You are under arrest now. Please We're not officer. playing this game. No please. I'm not playing no, game. no please, no officer, nothing. Please. And relax. Officer, I cannot. You can, no, you're under arrest and your vehicle's going to be towed now. Officer, let me call my wife to no. come pick up the not, not happening. You want to play stupid games, you're going to win stupid prizes. I don't want to pick Guess up. what? I'm pulling you over for a lawful reason. You've been obstructing my investigation from the beginning. You're refusing to me give, give me your information. That's called concealing identity. You're not following my commands to step out of the vehicle. You're not following my commands when I tell you to turn around. You're not getting in the car like we asked you. Do I need to go on? This list goes on and on. When we tell you to do something and we're giving you a lawful order, that's the way it is. I don't get if you understand or not. Does that make sense to you? Okay, so you are under arrest. I don't have anything. Why are you searching me? Are you searching me if I was like You're that? under arrest. That gives us the right to search you. For what reason? Obstructing an you're, officer you're and giving, concealing identity. Me, hey, why are you taking my stuff it's away? It's going with you, man. I'm just taking it off. Oh my! Uh, I just wanted you're under arrest. For what? He's not giving me no reason. I just told you multiple times. Can you start get a supervisor in here, please? Let me get a supervisor because you're under arrest. I'm getting the. I'm doing. You know, we'll put him in my car. Since I got. You're getting me the tip for no reason. I was. Oh my god. No. This is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. I just. I'm telling you that right now. Have a seat. Oh my god, officer, come on. Take a seat, dude. We'll turn to you right now. Just let me, what? You guys so, aren't telling me anything. I'm going to read your Miranda rights, okay? Another one. Yeah, go for it. All right, so hear me out. Don't interrupt me. Why should I give you my 39 if you're not giving me no explanations? We can detain you as a John Doe, and we'll keep you booked indefinitely until we figure out who you are. Officer, so be quiet and listen for two officer, seconds. Officer, you, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. Officer, you, you have the right to talk to a lawyer and have him present with you while you're being questioned. You can't afford to hire a lawyer. One will be appointed to represent you before any questioning if you wish. You can decide at any time to exercise these rights and not answer my questions or make any statements. Officer, Do you understand these rights as I've explained them to you? Yes or no? The yes or no question, yes, man. Yes, I do understand, but you just tell me for no reason, officer. No, I've explained to you ten times over I didn't what's going on. I break no laws. Do I need to explain it to you one you last time? No Are you willing laws. to listen? I'll explain to you I'm one last time. I, I've been okay, now do not interrupt me. If you interrupt mm -hmm. me, this door shuts and this conversation is over. I was going to stop you because I ran your license plate and the plates and insurance are suspended. The owner of this car has a warrant. That is why I'm going to stop you. I go to pull you over. As I come into the neighborhoods behind you, you're obviously going over the speed limit. You stopped at that stop sign for a half second. My lights were on. You did not pull over. I come to stop you. I tell you to roll your windows down. You don't listen. Once I tell you why I've stopped you, ask for your information, you're refusing to give me that information. You can't do that. It's called concealing identity. I've stopped you for a lawful reason. I don't care if you agree with it or not. You have to give your information. You refuse to give it. I tell you to exit the vehicle. You're argumentative. You don't listen. Looks like you have multiple warrants, which is probably why you've been acting the way you've been acting. They're being confirmed. You're already under arrest for obstructing an officer and concealing identity. There's some warrants you have, which are being confirmed. Can I make a, a call, please? We'll let you make a call in a bit. I have to arrange to call a tow truck. Anytime we arrest you by department policy, we tow the vehicle. Okay. No. Yes. That's not. That is true. I can, I can call someone to pick it up. That's not. We're they not. We're not before, doing that today. They done it before that they can pick come and pick it up. Now we cannot. If pick the it registered up. owner is on site at the time of the stop, I can release the vehicle to them. There is nobody else in that car, therefore I have to tow it. Okay. I've been pulled over. Swing, swing, been, swing your feet in. I've been pulled over. Well, this isn't the previous times. Swing your legs in. You're under arrest. Why? Swing your legs in. Why? Let me make a call. Put your leg. I have the rest to, to go to, inside. To talk. Take, put your feet in. Let me do our paperwork, and then maybe we can get a phone call. Okay? You do have the right for a phone call, but that's inside the jail. We're be, we're it's probably going to be nice think, and give you a phone call. I don't know that. I don't know that the numbers and right there. They don't let me. Get we will the phone. get your cell phone. If you need to make a call from your phone, we'll let you do that. But we're not going to do that with you not listening and keeping your leg in the way of the door. But I need to make a phone call right now. Please. It's not going to happen right I now. We have things we need to do. I have foot in my vehicle. Watch your foot. I don't want your foot getting I have slammed foot in, in the door. My vehicle, officer. I got Watch your to feet. Feed. We'll let you make a phone call in a bit, but you got to swing your foot in because we have to do what's called a tow inventory, and then we will worry let's about your phone. Let us do our thing, dude, and I'll talk to you right now. And if there's somebody that can come pick up the food, cool, but somebody can't come and get the vehicle, okay? So swing your foot in. You're already making this way harder than it has to be.
。男士明明知道自己为什么被逮捕，却还不停地问为什么。警察也耐心地跟他解释了好多次啊，车辆信息有问题，他又隐瞒身份，妨碍调查，所以警察才将他逮捕。警察也说了，如果只是车牌和保险有问题，那么警察愿意放他一马，一张罚单就搞定了。但是他本来就有逮捕令，还拒绝配合警察，又多了两项罪名，所以这是他自己造成的后果。警察提醒男士，以后只要跟警察打交道，那么就必须遵循警察的合法命令。这也是为了避免将事态升级。如果你觉得警察侵犯了你的某种权利，那么你可以事后起诉警察，而跟警察作对你是赢不了的。今天警察拦停你都是有合法理由的。警察还对男士说：“你今天被我拦停，还算是很幸运的，因为我很有克制力。换做其他的警察，在你拒绝下车的那一刻。”警察就可以电疗你了。我今天有两次电疗你的机会，但是我没用。后来，男士的女朋友也来到了现场。警察非常的有耐心啊，又把事情的来龙去脉向女朋友描述了一遍。最后，这位男士的结果也很糟糕。除了一系列的交通罚单和之前的逮捕令以外啊，他还被指控隐瞒身份、拒捕和妨碍公务。好了，本期的视频就到这里了，感谢观看。